Kings and Queens, it's your girl Essence of Shay. Let's get started. I'm a little disappointed in the lock community. I might, I must, I must say, I'm a little disappointed. So, when starting this channel, I didn't initially start um, with the hopes of bringing the lock community together and pushing them more in the forefront. I'll be honest, I first started off with cooking videos. And then I did a little singing stuff. Um, but my passion is still cooking. From time to time, I'll do cooking videos. But my passion more focused on lock hair and the community and self-love and just community as a, and sisterhood right so as the years went by and as we grow more um i'm loving the interaction and everything that's going on but the past couple weeks i've noticed some things and it's not even more so directed to me like there's the little scraggles that come in and say like dumb stuff but they bored, so I ain't paying them no attention. But I'm talking about like on other people's pages, like certain people have decided to like comb out their locks and or cut their locks. And the craziness that people have been saying under their their post they decided that their lock journey has ended and you guys are disappointed in it. I get it because these particular people probably are the reason why you have locks for instance if you come to my channel i probably in some way have convinced you to to start locks or to stay with locks and whatever it is but if i decide to um comb out my hair or to cut my locks even when i cut the side i got a little bit of some stuff but if i decide oh like i no longer want locks anymore like it's one thing if you say, okay, I'm not going to unfollow you anymore. I'm going to unfollow you. But to call me out my name or say that I'm fake or all this other stuff is actually quite ridiculous if, if you really think about it. Because at the end of the day, it's my hair. Do we get it? Or, or no? Like, this is not directed to me, but I've seen on other people's pages that you guys go literally in on somebody for making a decision with their hair like i'm baffled because when i was reading this stuff i was like is this my family like i consider you guys family like this is how y'all act when somebody cuts off or combs out their hair either way whatever they do they don't have locks anymore and this is how y'all treat them Y'all just was saying I love you and oh you're such an inspiration and uh, you're my crush and da 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 and then as soon as they alter something then it's a whole completely different conversation and not even like oh it's one thing to be like I'm very disappointed you know you were an inspiration but i understand but i'm gonna have to unsubscribe because you know peace and love to you but i am on a log journey and i just want to follow people who are on the same journey as me but yo you are fake you a fraud son and the only reason why you had locks is so you could get a big following and once you got the following then you out like are y'all serious that's their hair like <laughs> what are you talking about like you cannot sit there and degrade somebody for making a decision to no longer have locks. Like, I thought we was better than this. Like, real talk. I really thought we were better than this. But that's really all I had to say. Like, we got to do better as a community, as an individual. We just got to do better and express ourselves on a more intellectual, more respectable manner. Like... Because bashing somebody else and calling them out their name and threatening them because of hair, bruh? Hair? Come on. Nah. Nah. But 
The only reason why I'm speaking about this is like, it's not really my battle, but it kind of is my battle because I'm in this community and I hold a, a flag for the lot community. And like I told you guys, after the whole Essence Magazine thing, like I really want us to be on a higher playing field like the curly heads, but we can't be out here like diminishing others because they no longer have locks because it makes us as a community look bad. It makes us look like people looking at us like, oh, I ain't want to mess with them because they have, they like, they wicked. Like, nah, we're not that at all, at all. You guys can be mad, but express yourself in different ways is all I'm saying. Anyways, um, if you understand what I'm saying and agree with what I'm saying, leave comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Even if you don't agree, you can leave comments below. Like, I don't want y'all to be agreeing with everything I say. You get what I'm saying? That's not the point of this at all. But constructive criticism and, like, respectful criticism is all I'm saying. Um, so, yeah. I'm disappointed. We gotta do better. And yeah, um, see you later, Tiger Lilies. Toodles. Uh, crash course.